Hi, it's Lauren Lockman from the Tanglewood Wellness Center, and I'm here this afternoon with Lucia. Lucia has just completed a 21-day fast, almost finished with refeeding, and you're heading home tomorrow, leaving tomorrow. Leaving tomorrow. Heading home on Thursday. Yes. Right. Okay. So, Lucia, tell us about your experience. So, I did a 21-day fast. Right. Right. And um, it wasn't that hard, actually. No? The worst symptom was horrible breath. Okay. And um, that I kept thinking about food, which can get a bit of, a bit annoying. Right. Um, but elsewise, I didn't have horrible symptoms. Okay, so what was your primary reason for coming to do this in the first place? I guess there were many reasons. Maybe the primary, I don't know, I'm discovering it. I okay. just, for a long time I felt a pull, you know, to cleanse, mm -hmm. to do a fast, to have better health, to be, to become a better athlete. And also, kind of, I like have an emotional, mental fast. Mm -hmm. And I thought, you know, physical fast would help as well. Sure. Which it has. Sure. Um, and like minor reasons. So you had some minor health challenges, but nothing serious? No, nothing serious. Okay. Now, I mean, it's one thing, you know, some people can say, well, so might say, well, I understand someone who's got something serious they're trying to heal. Right. But you're, how old are you? 20. You're 20 years old. 20. You're, you're a young woman. You weren't, you weren't sick. So was this really beneficial for you? Um, I've just been eating for three days, okay. and I haven't had a bowel movement, which may, it might be why I'm not so, um, I don't feel as good as I hoped I would, uh -huh. but I, I definitely believe I have had some really, really good cleansing, which is like everybody needs cleansing, and, and also I think, well, I believe it's natural for human beings to go without from time to time, without and mo and without eating, without eating and not scarcity. But like we, I came from Christmas with just this abundance, we can't get like big right. growth, and then come to a place where it's not all about food and just I don't know if I can explain. Just get the food out of your system. Stop and focusing mind. on food. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. Good. But also like physically, yeah. So, have there been some specific benefits that you've already realized? I, I remember I wrote about them yesterday. I can't think of them now. But you wrote them, there, so there were some? Yeah, there were some. Okay. I, I wish I could remember. And have there been other benefits, emotional benefits? Yeah, definitely. Okay. Um, I used to have this really bad obsession with food and thinking about it all the time. And since I've been eating, I've been relishing every bite, mm. like enjoying it. Like you have no, that's an incredible benefit, tasting okay. food. And the way I can taste now is like I'm, I've just been reborn, you know, it's so amazing. So food tastes much better, doesn't it? Because you've like, got new taste buds. Yeah, that's yeah. really, really good benefit. And what was I talking about? You were talking about benefits. About benefits, yeah. yeah. So that's a really good benefit. Oh yeah, so I was like thinking about food all the time and now I enjoy it and I eat slowly and I relish it, but I'm not obsessed with it. That's terrific. That's that's huge. That is huge. I, mean, I, I suspect there are, I know, there are a lot of women your age who are obsessed with food. Yes. And it's clearly not the healthiest thing one can do. Okay, that's so really um, overall, how would you characterize your experience here? The thing is that I I think I'm, I cannot say right now, because I'm just... I think I'm a crucial point of my, but, but the, over, the fast of itself. No, your entire experience here has been good, has it's been, been positive. It's been really good. Do you like it here? Has it I do. It's beautiful. Lauren's amazing. Oh, thank you. The people are great. It's peaceful. You can relax. I really like it. Good. Okay. Well, maybe, you know, if it's okay with you and we both can find a, just a couple minutes tomorrow, maybe we'll check in with you tomorrow after that first bowel movement. It's going to happen. I hope so. It will. It's going to happen. Okay. Yeah, that'd be great. Okay. Thank you. Hi, Lucia. Hi. It's, uh, it's Wednesday morning. We, uh, we spoke last evening, and you had not had a bowel movement yet. It was your third day. Not. And fourth, fourth day. 
yesterday? That's my fourth day. Was your fourth day? Yeah. Okay. So, that's right. Um, and I think I told you all along, what, three to five days, yeah. you'd have your first problem. So, what happened? <laughs> I had my first bowel movement. Let's talk some shit. You I had a bowel movement. It. Yeah, it was amazing. Oh, it was an amazing bowel movement. It was amazing. I don't know <clears throat> what was better, my first taste, like my first food, uh -huh. or my first bowel movement. This is a woman <laughs> who likes exciting. to eliminate. Yes. Well, when you really need to, it feels good, doesn't it? Yes. And, and what happened for you afterward? Did you feel much better? It was like the moment I flushed the toilet. It was like a wave of relief yeah. all over my body. <clears throat> my Head start stopped hurting, my back stopped hurting. I slept so well, and I feel like right now I feel amazing. Yeah, terrific. Well, that's great. So congratulations. Thank you. That's that's a wonderful result. I'm <laughs> glad is. that happened for you. Thank and you. And you're much. um, you're on your way out to San Jose. You've got a, a flight tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow afternoon. Okay. okay. So, out. was there anything else you wanted to add before we we wrap up? Um, nothing, just that it's an amazing experience and you shouldn't miss out. And Lauren, thank you so much. You were very helpful and, and nice and just informative all the time. And I really thank you so much. Oh, it's been a real pleasure having you here. It's been a joy. Okay. Thank you and, and best of luck to you. Hopefully we'll see you again sometime. Yes, definitely. Okay.